Sounds a call. I'm doing pretty good. How's it going? Is it Jaylene or Jalen? And hi, Alex. I'm going to be doodling a type of face, I guess. I'm not quite sure. But, um, yeah, I've been doing digital drawing, so I switched over to doing this for today's stream. And I moved my, um, chats and everything up here let's say um it's just a big round stick medium it's a ballpoint pen as a red ink you can pick these up anywhere dollar store it's like a dollar <laughs> alex rondazzo it sounds like italian jay <laughs> okay I just had some like turkey or something and I had rice with it yesterday but I have to do my dishes <laughs> so that I can make the rice because the pan was all dirty but it's there's so much dishes and I was hungry and I want to start a live stream so I just like cooked up some eggs and like mixed them with it so it was like breakfast <laughs> Yeah, I don't, I don't know what this is going to be, but I, I know that, um, I think that my drawing's gotten better from doing digital because I think digital is more difficult in the fact that you don't have as much control with what you're, um, drawing with. I listened to that chill music from the other channel. <laughs> it was pretty good. I uh, I have like a, a whole another roll of that turkey stuff that I can use. I think it's three pounds of it. <laughs> it's 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 bed breakfast. It's, it's my time zone is bedtime. Yeah, I guess we have different, complete opposite schedules. Although I have been sleeping completely different. I've been going to bed at like 6 in the morning. Like today I didn't wake up till 12.30. 5.07 p.m. I think it's... Yeah, it's the same time here, 5.08. I do a little bit of writing. Um, I mean, not not like books or nothing. I do um, poetry. I 
think anybody could learn to draw. It's a matter of pulling the time in. And you have, have to have a lot of patience, that's for sure. It's 4.08 for you, p.m. <laughs> you don't have patience. <laughs> I would say if you want to get better, um, Spend a lot of time just repetitively drawing it over and over, um, like human anatomy, and drawing figures and faces, and just spend a lot of time studying the um, the contrast between the lighting and the shadows. Because if you want to draw something realistic, there's never really any like hard lines or um, uh, straight lines, everything's shadows and different shades of things. <laughs> I'm pretty good at drawing and painting, but not good at writing. I wish I was good at both. Uh, well, I guess everybody's, everybody's got something they're good at and things they're bad at. Like, I'm horrible at math. I'm super horrible at math. I think I'm, I'm, I must be like second grade math. That's about it. Thanks, Jay. I think, I don't know if I want to continue trying to make more of the face or just add some doodly things to the side of it. I'm trying to decide. Can you hear me well? And is the video quality pretty good? When did I really get into it? Or like when did I start or when did I start improving? Cause I've, I started drawing, I was like five. And I've always drawn since then, but I've really gotten into it a lot more in the past year. Cause I focus more on um, anatomy and drawing proportions and everything. I have a hard time drawing those sometime. <laughs> Mr. Redpin. Thank you. Yeah, some, sometimes if I'm doing the stream and out of nowhere, I'm just like, I don't say anything because I'll, I get really focused. But I'm pretty much just chilling with it right now because I'm listening to that relaxing music. Times I've done um, really realistic ones, I don't have any music on and they take me like 100 hours. These are the ones that are... Um, I guess my masterpiece versions. Because I've done a couple of taking me six months.
the problem I have sometimes when I'm drawing a whole bunch is my pinky starts hurting because of like having my hand like this. A piece of paper to wipe off um, the excess ink, which is what you're supposed to do, but I'm not taking the drawing too serious. I'm just kind of, I'm just chilling. Okay. Yeah, I shouldn't disappear or anything because I have a pretty decent internet connection. <laughs> hmm. I'm trying to think what else I should add to. thing I'm having to try to get used to now is when I was doing digital drawing I was able to make a layer and then after that layer I could draw over it and then erase that <laughs> but this I'm just eyeballing it I get the shadows, the nose, because the light's coming this way. This is going to be darker here. Um, shape of it. And a little bit of light's going to hit there. But there's the part of the cheek where the skin folds over. You want that uh, a little bit darker. Well, or two should always say that you have to be a bit lighter to draw on your face. Yeah, <laughs> I guess so. Um, one thing that helps me is trying to draw more realistic is to imagine things in my head three-dimensionally rather than just looking at the, uh, the surface, how it looks when you look directly at it. Try to imagine in my head and like look at it from all the different angles so that my drawing, I can understand the shape of it better. I'm just going to draw the shadow from this nose casting over some and see how that looks. Was that when you were in high school or middle school? I um I actually was I mean I I think I was pretty bad at art when I was in art class because they wanted me to draw it a certain way and I just don't learn that way um so I had to teach myself I was feeling my safe my face to give myself an idea of where to put um, this line work. Middle school, senior high school. No, <laughs> that makes me feel old because I'm. I think next year will be 10 years since I have graduated high school already. It's went by fast. It feels like it was last year that I was still in high school, but 
It's been nine years, going on ten years now. I have no idea. I'm just making this person up. <laughs> this is going to be like a face. And then uh, I'm going to add some like a lot of my abstract designs and stuff to it after that. I don't think I'm going to completely draw the right side of the face. Um, I'm going to draw some other stuff on that side. This has to be darker here, the nose, because underneath the shadow. But there's a little bit of light that catches this here, coming across, but not that much. Yeah, I, uh, I'll do some streams here later. Um, maybe later today, I'm not sure, it depends on what I'm doing. But I'll do some streams where I'll do some uh, portrait drawing. I'm not, I'll show you some uh, some of my stuff from my sketchbook. Some of my doodles. Let's see. Do you want to see the abstract stuff or the portrait stuff? So I got like tiny portraits in this one. So this is uh, some like abstract doodle no I just realized I need to turn the screen upside down so you guys can see it the right way hold on a second I have my uh, I have the whole screen upside down. I didn't realize that. I'm gonna fix that real quick. I'm gonna go to transform, flip vertical. There, I fixed it. But this is like some abstract thing, and uh, I'm gonna move myself over here now. <laughs> but um this is like some abstract thing I did. And then these are like a bunch of spoons. I don't know, I'll draw a bunch of kitchen utensils. And there's a family member and a friend. This is with like gel pen and that's with ballpoint. That's my little nephew. And then this one is some like landscape scene I sketch real quick from when I lived in Florida. There's some of my friends. Both of them I sketched out. And it's like some rapper. And that's of a sprinter. There's Jim Carrey over here. Then this one on the right is of one of my subscribers. That's of one of my subscribers as well, the one on the left. And then the one on the right is of a friend. And then I don't know what I was doing there. I started something, but that's nothing. And that was like a 10 minute sketch of one of my friends as well. Uh, some leaf I didn't finish and then we find it that must be my other sketchbook I have another one of someone and this is my doodle book my I use my rotary isographs in it I call this one Paris 2250 AD. These are like 
Got a bunch of abstract faces. And this is, I tried drawing with the dip pen, but it didn't work out right. More abstract stuff. Abstract bird. And then a uh, butterfly. This is what's roaching isographs. This is a more detailed um, doodle. And there's another one. This one's not finished. I drew myself as some machine. <laughs> there was like some uh, scene for when I lived down in Florida. I was drawing from the front porch, well, how it used to look. And then, no idea who this is, just making it up. But I, um, I've got lots of sketchbooks over here. And pens and everything. If you have, I have a video on my channel that uh, I show all my art supplies. I've got like a <laughs> hundred sketchbooks. I gotta add the shadow from the cheek that comes just from where the uh, nose is. And thank you, I'm glad you like it, what I made. All of my strange <laughs> random doodles. <laughs> And listen to the chill music stuff again. <clears throat> I need a piece of paper for under my hand. There we go. Look at the shadow, because there's that part of the skin above the lip that is in shadow usually. I'm craving lemonade again and spaghetti, even though I can't even have lemonade because of sugar in it. I have to eat, like, or have, um, just water and milk. That pretty boy. <laughs> Drawing traditional is so much easier now from doing so much digital. I 
And I have no idea who this person is either. If there's anything you want me to draw, if you want me to do a drawing of you, I can do it on the live stream sometime. I'm trying to implement um, recently doing abstract that's like mixed with realism or portraits and stuff for a different look. Okay, hope you have a good day too. Thank you for joining and I'll see you in the next live stream if you come back. I'll be doing these way more often. I'll probably do one maybe every other day. Kind of depends, but you have a good night. One moment.
Hello, welcome. I see a new person has joined.
Hello, how's it going? How's it going, Bobby? I don't know what this thing's turned into. It was just like a face, but now there's all kind of robotic stuff I just added to it. Hi, Bobby's friend. <laughs> if, if any of you have anything you want me to draw in the next stream, I can do it. Like, especially if uh, you have any, like a picture of you, you want me to draw as a portrait, I can do that on a live stream because I want to practice doing um, portrait drawings. This face is kind of starting to look scary.
What did she, uh, what did she think of my strange rolling so far? Um, it kind of depends. Well, right now I'm off of work. I'm changing jobs. I'll be starting up a different job here in like a couple weeks. But even when I start my um, different job, I'll be streaming um, as often as I can. I'll try to um, like schedule streaming events, but it kind of just depends. I'll be doing a few streams a week at least. But uh, right now I've been doing one or two streams every day. Yeah, I had uh, to uh, take a break from using my drawing tablet so much because I've had it for two weeks and I've com almost completely worn down the um, matte screen protector. It usually takes people six months to do that, but when you're drawing, you know, um, ten or more hours every day like I do, I, uh, I wear things out a lot faster. That's why I've got, like, I've got more of these, but this is an example of like how many pins I have. I have like 30 more sets of these, so I shouldn't run out anytime soon on pins. <laughs> but my drawing tablet, uh, it's it's really convenient for um, the painting. I just I, like when it comes to line art, I prefer using it's erase like a basic pen. Tell her I said thank you. I'll draw her some abstract flower. Um, maybe later tonight, maybe tomorrow, kind of depends. But I can do something like that for her. And uh, Teller said thank you for complimenting my work as well. What's up, Otaku? Okay, thank you. Uh, I think I'm under like a snake or something here. I don't know why, but this time I'm drawing on this building. <laughs> I gotta draw all these little scales. Oh, my hand. Oh yeah, I uh, yeah, I've watched a lot of his stuff. Um, 
I've had some people that say that a lot of my work looks like his, but when I first started drawing, I started out um, being inspired by like the great masters such as um, Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo, um, all of those guys, and my goal was always to try to render things hyper-realistic and um, trying to follow in that footsteps, but I kind of expanded from there and started doing abstract and kind of like doodly stuff. And just because I did so much realistic drawing, it helped me to where abstract was just, it was more freeing and I could just relax a lot when I was doing it. So it wasn't you know, quite as, I wouldn't say stressful is the word, but just when I'm doing like realistic stuff, I'm like hyper focused, kind of like when I was doing the face. But, um, yeah, Peter draws his, uh, his work's pretty interesting. Um, I study a lot of it to help with my drawing as well. Although he has like 600 and like 10,000 followers, subscribers, I think I only have 216. I actually have more videos than I have subscribers. I have 200 and this is my 235th video that I've made. I took a break for a month. And so, my goal is to do one video a day, but because I took a break for a month, I'm going to at least double that, and over the course of the next month, I'm going to be doing two videos a day at least, of like live streaming or something to make up for it. Two eighteen. Oh, okay. I, yeah, I guess it will be two eighteen. I thought I was still at like two thirteen or something this morning. I forget how many. I don't pay attention too much to the amount of subscribers. Um, although my goal is, which would be nice, is to make a living drawing. Um, I don't let the how many subscribers I have determine whether or not I enjoy drawing. Cause I just I do it for the fun of it. And just because it's, it's a personal goal. But I will be taking a break here in a few minutes. Um, now we'll, I'll be recontinuing the stream here. Um, I just I'm gonna go eat here in a minute, and um, gonna stretch, and I'll continue doing this drawing again. Um, as another stream. So if I sit here for like hours and I don't take a break, my back starts hurting and then I don't feel good and then I have a hard time drawing then. I can't focus. But I like the way this is turning out, even though I'm not sure what it is. I have no idea what any of it is. Oh, she actually recommended my stream to you. Was it from uh, was that music station that I was listening to, or did she just like find me?
My house is uneven. Everything keeps rolling that way. <laughs> Every time I try to set the pen up to stay, it doesn't. Hold on a second. Let's see. My house rolls that way. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, that I'll I'll be doing another one of him. Um, I'll I'll, I'll try a digital one. Then I'll be trying a um traditional one as well. Um, in ballpoint. But uh, yeah, I think that that video has the most views of any of my drawings. I think it has like four hundred maybe. I think most of my videos only get like thirty views. I think that's about all. <laughs> oh yeah, oh, because I drew a snake. Snake G. <laughs> I, I think the drawing I did of Peter Jules only took me maybe an hour and a half. It, it, they usually don't take that long. Like this is only taking me an hour. But um, I haven't done um, traditional in a couple of weeks, so. Oh man. But I'm gonna go take a quick break for a little bit, and when I get back, I'll start another stream, and I'll be drawing. Cause I'm gonna go eat. And my back sore, I need to stretch. But I'm gonna go do that, and I'll eat and everything. Then I'll be doing a uh, another stream here later. But I want to thank all of you for being here, the ones of you that showed up, and look forward to making more live streams for everyone. And remember, if you get any um, drawing suggestions or anything of what you want me to do in another stream, just um, go ahead and comment. Uh, let me know, and I can do one for you. Especially if you got like a portrait you want me to do of uh, one of your friends or of you. I can do that in the live stream. But for now, I'm uh, going to take a quick break. And when I get back, I will be continuing this drawing. And we'll see what I can make from there. I'll see you later. <laughs>